Hello everyone, welcome back. This is Des Jones of Mega Des Metas bringing guys more Pokemon Sun post game. This is the final island scan, and it is a Leaveny. At the Pony Metal, which ironically we have not been to yet, so let's go and explore there. Uh, Pony Gauntlet, I would like to explore next episode again, because further down Pony Gauntlet, to my knowledge, Let's fly over there actually. Let's just glide. To my knowledge, that's where the battle tree is at. So let's go fly to the meadow. Here we are. The meadow is right in here. I like how lucky I have been so far with, um, you know, the whole throwing quick balls and catching things on the first try. Oh, look! And we found our Leavening in the first try as well. That's also really lucky. Sometimes it takes a couple encounters to find these guys. Alright, Snorlax is getting closer and closer to level 50. I only have 8 quick balls left. <laughs> Alright, here's hoping it works. It's been working about 90% of the time, so... No! Okay, this is one of the times it doesn't work. And there it goes with the swords dance. Great. Leaving is really fast, so we can't... Oh, I don't want to run anyway. Um, let's just try a regular old-fashioned Giga Impact and see if we kill it or not. Another Swords Dance. Man, how much is, does he need to bring his attack up? <laughs> Come on. Let's do that. Okay, that did a decent amount of health. What the heck is it doing? Entertainment? So that switches... That switches our st stuff and things, our abilities, with him. Okay, well, Conductor, come on in. Now, Thunderbolt will definitely kill it, but we want to get that Paralysis in here. That is why I'm bringing you in. That's... really... Yeah. There he goes again with his Swords Dance. Oh, leave any. Uh, thunder wave. <laughs> yeah, this attack stat won't go up any higher. You've done enough padding that is attack stat, Leaveny. You're done. Now, ooh, can just give him that little bit, that wee little bit of a tug there. Um, maybe type no. Maybe with a crush claw. Perhaps? I don't know. Because he has a lower level, so I might be able to get away with it. I don't know. We definitely aren't doing a takedown or an X Scizor because of his grass typing. So let's see what Crush Claw does. That's enough. That's closest that we're gonna get. Hold back might have been okay to keep just for this, but I think. We will just try an Ultra Ball on him and see if it stays in that. Well, Ultra Ball might be overdoing it, but I don't want to take any risks. I want to throw, don't want to throw a bunch of po different Pokeballs at him. Oosh. Okay. Well, it is. It's not nighttime yet, but we are in a place that might be considered. A cave, so maybe a dusk ball might work. Let's try it. Come on, come on. Two, three. Come on, Leonie. Haha, -ha, there we go. It was a bit of a gamble with that dusk ball, but I'm, I think I, I'm glad I got it. Conductor and Snorlax, everyone gets experience. Good job, everyone. Let's not name it. Let's check its summary. Now, I think the top move is its special move. Me first. Really. Me first is a kind of a silly move, I think. He only has one attack. <laughs> the other attacks are status moves. Alright, let's send you to a box. Bye-bye. Alright. There's the end of that. Now. Oh. There was a Zygarde cube here in the daytime. I guess we'll have to come back and grab that. Because I did notice that when we looked here earlier. 
There's a Provo Pass, and... Huh. There's also a place to take a picture! Let's fire up the Pokefinder, why not? Let's see what we got here. Mm-hmm. Anything in the bushes? In the water there? What about up here? Oh, there we go. Uh, it's an... It's an Oricorio. Alright. Occasionally comes down. Ah, there we go. All right, let's see if we can get a, get a better shot than that. Okay, got two more shots. Let's make them count. Mm-hmm. I am on fire. Okay. This camera's on fire! Okay, uh, maybe not that one. Maybe not that one. That one's pretty good, I think. No, no, and ooh, that's a tough choice between this one and this one. I think I'm gonna go with this one. Let us show off this one to my Twitter. Just kill or whatever. Can't really see much. <laughs> it's night, nighty night. Okay, so we still have to get this camera to version 4. We're kind of a long ways away from that. I don't think we're going to make that a thing in our L LP at all. That's okay. I don't really need to know what version 4 is unless we get something really important from it. But I doubt that we do. The rippling went away. Well, why would I want to go and do anything over here then? It's probably going to be a freaking... Um, a <laughs> magic carp, and I don't really care about fighting those. Oh, it's a brooch! A barbara. Okay. I don't think we've encountered those at all. Though I do have one, apparently, so we will run. Or just kill it. I really don't want to use a Giga Impact on it, though. Eh, let's just run. Th that kind of experience is not worth our time. I guess any experience is good, but... What made the ripple go away, though? Alright, lady. When I got hurt over here, this probe pass right here carried me all the way back to town. And that's interesting. Okay, probe pass. So if I faint here, will you take me back to town, too? Alright. Purple Nectar, obviously, for changing Oricorio into a form we just took a picture of. There is a Pokeball up there. Okay. More Nectar. Oh, this is Igar cute. Right there, but I can't get to it. Well, it's two branching paths. I think I will go this way first. Because they, we saw that item first. And I think that's the only place to go. Okay then. Moving on. Da 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 da, da to the next tree path. Moving on. Okay. These rocks cannot be broken. Ah, TM splendid overheat. Alright, we got that. It was a nice thing to put into a wonderful little backpack. Oh, there's a ro Rombi? Rombi? I have to apologize for yesterday. I was stupid tired. <laughs> You'll see the cut, many cuts of me that when I do the thing. I'm just, yeah. I was recording at 10 o'clock at night. And that's why. <laughs> so, because as soon as I get home, baby needed my attention, apparently. Stephanie needed me to feed, give me, give her a ball because she had to do something else. And she was with baby all day, so that's why I couldn't get the recording right at 
Well, that we also had some food. So I got done work at 9. But I had to record because I didn't want to miss the island scan, and so that's why I was all tired yesterday. Anyway, long story short, I was tired yesterday. <laughs> feel bad because I didn't really get that much done. I did the island scan and then I and then basically I fought one trainer or two. Oh. Okay, well this is the way we need to go to get to that Zygarde cube. And now let's head back and run through this grass again. Let's just walk. I don't want to trigger any encounters. I don't want any Pokemon to be triggered. Just <laughs> jokes. Oh, today's the I don't even get me started on that crap. Oh, a cave. I either should explore it now or later. Okay, now we can explore that cave. Because <laughs> there's nothing else over here. Let's cross here. This meadow is very interesting. It's all misty and has like... Resolution cave. Oh, so this is a new area. Don't think. Oh, Mudsdale, we need you. Resolution Cave might be a new area that we'll have to deal with some other time. But we are here now, and it's only 12 minutes into the recording, so I think we can do it. Um, a gold bat. I think we want. Rocky to take care of it. Let's not use up all of our... or Dusty. I said Rocky when I meant Dusty. Our Lycan Rock. Come on out, Lycan Rock. Let's Stone Edge this thing. Or Rock Slide, or what have you. Doesn't matter what. Not very effective. Let's Rock Slide. Rock Slide into your face. Go back. Bye-bye. Down it goes, ta, and a level up for our wonderful little Dusty. We might have to, yeah. Let's put uh, let's put Type Null in the front because why not? Snorlax did just gain a level, so let's switch things up. Okay, now we got some trainers here. I think I will leave her alone for right now. Let's explore what's up here first. Oh, I see. I mean... <laughs> dang it. <laughs> Wrong button. Okay, let's pick up what's here. Okay, an elixir. Well, laddie freaking da. Ooh, I shouldn't run in here. Because encounters. Well, we need to grind anyway. Ah, uh, right. Techno, I want you to evolve soon. That would be great. We got you at level 40. Let's start with a takedown. Maybe we should just use our Z move. Quick guard. Hmm. Never seen that move before. Nor do I know what it does. Let's do a metal claw. Or crush claw. There you go, we have your quick guard. Is this something that protects against crits or something? Now he's calling for help. Great. Now we're going to have two gold bats to deal with. Yep. I called it. <laughs> you can tell when these things work sometimes. Um, well, Crush Claw the girl. Still, all I want to do is spam that quick guard. I don't know what that does. And there's Haze. Well, now our stats, our changes were eliminated, which we did none. So that was very useful. Stupid. Pokemon, you need a trainer. You need a trainer good. I don't know why I'm yelling at the game. <laughs> oh, God, guys. Now he's calling for help. Okay, I think I'm going to have to switch to my Dusty. Okay, his help didn't appear. 
so that's fine. Let's do another takedown, because we were able to take out the one. Pretty in like two moves, so I think we're okay. I don't think there's any need for us to switch. We got avoided. If they didn't pick up on our pickup lines, they rejected us. Just kidding. That was, that's something else entirely. Uh, take down. Go. I guess I had to actually select which one. Which slot? Crush claw. Finish it off. Looks like he did not call for help last turn. Awesome. Now he's calling for help. Oh, you gotta be kidding me. Are we going to just be grinding on this one gold bat set? Okay, good. His help did not show up. Next. Then we're gonna finish this off. <laughs> and Mr. Smart Gold Bat decides to do another haze. Oh, eliminate our stat changes when we had none. Alright. Alright, let's get back on our Mudsdale and go down here and let's uh let's battle this lady in our in our ride gear my outward face is that of a back powder Blech, a back powder uh, my outward face is that of a backpack what about my inward face your inward face is muscles and bone you should not take off your outward face because muscles and bone are not very <laughs> appreciative by backpacker Mariah or Maria, however you'd like to pronounce that. Probably Maria. Sends out em an emolga. Oof. Oh, emolgas. I remember you guys from P P Pokemon Black. You... Oh. oh, what was the trainer's name again? Um... It was... Freak. What's her name? Discharge. Yeah, that's nice. That's nice. Go take this Z move. Anyway, uh, it was a gym leader. She had this show that she did. What was her name? Eliza or something like that? Eh, whatever. It's been years ago. Can't be expected to remember everything. But her Amoga was not a fun Pokemon to go up against. That's just, wait, 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 that's as much as I remember. All right, Backpack Maria. You guys are strong. I could not steal a glorious victory. Oh, so your inward face is a thief, is it? <laughs> no, but like I said before, your inward face. Oh, oh. We need to have a Tauros. Let's break through here. I heard something fall. Alright, we got ourselves a wonderful TM, the best TM in the game, Earthquake, in my personal opinion. Okay, it looks like nothing can walk through here, so we shall. Oh, I thought that was the end of the line. Oh, okay, an encounter. What do we have here? Another cool bat. Are you kidding me? Okay, I don't have time. I don't have time for this. Type now. Break it, clicks. Let's do it. Go. The heck, that probably should heal. Probably should heal. Maybe just a little bit. Just a bit. Would be great. All right. And break it, let's go. Head bop! Excuse me for how I was yelling there. No, he's calling for help. Well, didn't happen. My Z move didn't look like it did too much. More than a regular kind of Z move. A regular move, rather. I wonder how <laughs> much better these Z moves actually are. Alright, Type Null has gained two levels. Let's put Snorlax back in the front. 
All right, so that's, who? Oh, terrain extender? What the heck is a terrain extender? <laughs> what? <laughs> it's not that one. Terrain extender, okay. An item held by a Pokemon extends the duration of the terrain that caused the footholder's move or ability. So it extends the number of turns. Where a Pokemon uses like grassy terrain and such like that? I guess is what that's saying? Maybe? Alright, we've been that way, we've been that way, let's go down. Okay, where there's rocks there's probably a dead end, so let's take care of these rocks first. Hello, hiker! In this case, I'll ask you, what do you think a mountain is? Uh, rocks and trees and trees and rocks? And water. Occasionally. Wait, that's Canada. <laughs> Sorry, that's a stupid song by the arrogant worms. You are challenged by Hiker Travis. I don't know if you want me- I already have a YouTube video where I sing that. So I don't know if I should refer you guys to it or not, or if I should just sing it right now. <laughs> It's silly. All right. You're a steel type and a ground type. Don't you? Ooh, I don't think my Snorlax can handle your typesness. Therefore, either Epona because she is 59 or Beach Ball because she is water. Let's do Epona. Let's earthquake these guys' butts. Come on, Epona. Don't know how much more there is to this cave, but... I hope to be done soon, so we can end this little episode and take on the gauntlet next time. Goodbye, Dr. Yo. It's been nice knowing you. I've met many of your friends and always landed a critical hit on their butts. I don't know why I'm singing random stuff. <laughs> hey. Alright, Mudsdale versus Mudsdale. Um, nah. Let's switch. Let's bring in Beach Ball. Good. And do a Hydra Pump to it. Bye, Epona. Come on out, Beach Ball. I know you can do it. Here we go. Beach Ball is going to throw a Hydra Pump to your face. Take that to your face, Mudsdale. Well, it's just kind of below his face, so but that's okay. It's close enough. You know, Green Marine, you really need to work on your aim. <sighs> what strength! Just like a mountain. That's right. Like a rock. As strong as I can be, like a rock. <sighs> oh, look. A thing. A stardust. Nice. Okay, I'm gonna quickly take this opportunity to heal my Pokemon using berries. So I will be back with you in just a second. Citrus berries for everyone! Especially Snorlax. Okay, everyone's healed. Let's continue down this path. Well, let's get off our Pokemon and let's see what's inside here. <laughs> 